hey guys welcome back to another vlog today is wednesday the 27th <sighs> who wants a baby update um went to the doctor this morning blood pressure is not the greatest so i have to go in tomorrow for a visit with the nurse they're going to compare my blood pressure cuff to their blood pressure cuff because when i go into the office my blood pressure isn't terrible but it's still high for me um and then i wasn't supposed to start going to my weekly visits until the 10th of april they decided to start seeing me weekly starting this week so this week next week and then like so on and so forth so i have baby because of my blood pressure and things like that, he could actually come, like, any day if my blood pressure is acting up. Any day. So, yeah, we got a few more things to get taken care of. But overall, he is good and healthy. His movements are fine. His heart is fine. He's growing. I've gained four, I've gained a total of 14 pounds this pregnancy. Um, So, we got about four weeks to go. So, we'll see. Y'all probably... I'm hoping... I only gain about 20 pounds because that'll be easy to lose. I've lost 50 pounds. I can lose 20 pounds. So, um, yeah, let's go ahead. My comforters finally came in. So I'm going to strip. I'm going to go ahead and open these with you guys and show you guys what they are. They're also linked on my Amazon storefront under home. Ethan, can you get me my tripod, please? I'm wondering why there's three huge boxes. Two are understandable because two of them are comforter sets. I don't understand why there's such a big box for the sheets. This one might be PR. Wait. <gasps> no. I don't know. Let's open these and see exactly what's in what. Y'all yeah. need to make sure that bathroom's clean. Clean the floor around the toilet. Clean the whole toilet. Front, the back, the sides, the floor, back, the floor. Okay, I don't know what's in this third box, y'all, because these are my sheets. It's pretty neutral floral ones. I have some pillow covers and new throw pillow inserts that are gonna go. That's gonna go beautiful with these flowers. In my cart, <laughs> I have not ordered them yet. Brian said to wait to order them. Here is the fitted sheet. I wonder. Who knows how to fold a fitted sheet? It was pretty. I got 100% cotton. Oh, it's going to feel so good. Got two pillowcases. This is the one for mine and Brian's room. So a nice, happy color. I need new curtains for our room now. <gasps> With um, pillow shams. So. I got a quilt. It's hard to find 100% cotton, uh, like field, like, the feeling to be comforter because once you put like polyester or anything in it like that, it lowers the level of like the healing power of linen, which is cotton. So, if I did apply for a piece, yep, it's exactly what I thought it was. Yeah. So I got this off a of TikTok shop. It's to carry the baby. So you can, it's 100% cotton. 100%, what? 
All right, you guys, so I don't know if you guys noticed, but I got rid of our microwave. We no longer have a microwave. Our, our, our place, Wonder Oven can actually reheat food just like a microwave, but the only thing it can't do is like make popcorn. So it's gonna be my first time making a popcorn like this. So let's just see how it goes. Okay, gas range or camp stove. Preheat for three to four minutes at medium high setting. the whole seven minutes. <laughs> hey, bye bye. Go put that box um, on the floor by the baby's bed. This is what it looks like. I will upload a picture of the pillow covers that I have that I'm gonna order for it. Or like the decorative pillows. What are they call throw pillows. So this is what it looks like. I'm so happy with it. I think it looks so pretty. I feel like it's very giving off very mature, <laughs> but it's gonna not look so bland once I get those throw pillows. And maybe I'll get like a little throw blanket to go across 
All right, you guys, we got the guest bed done. Oh, now it's ready for Raquel. The towels are ready. It's all ready for her and my father-in-law and mother-in-law. I love how cute it came out. Kind of gives cowboys vibes though, don't it? <laughs> Rich supply of food from glands in their heads. During its egg and larva stages, Nurse Bee will feed feed it more than a hundred thousand times. Look at that. What do the larva do? Let me see. Let me see. Yeah. Hey guys, today is Thursday actually it's friday the um 30th no 29th today's friday the 29th raquel is on her way ah, so excited but um i'm going to go ahead and start organizing this cart for postpartum so that way whenever we go to the store later i know exactly what i need so i'm gonna go ahead and get that done and then i think i'm gonna start putting my no, because I got to go to the store for that. But I can pack some stuff in my um, hospital bag. So we'll start getting that together. Again, there's some stuff that Raquel is bringing that's for my hospital bag. And then there's also stuff that we're going to go to the store later and buy and look at baby stuff and whatnot. But she'll be here at 3 o'clock. It is 12.07, so we have three more hours. Um, I'm going to go ahead and try to do this fast so that way I can make the boys and I lunch. I think we're just going to do sandwiches today with some chips. Or ramen, I'm not sure. But I did go ahead and clean both the bathrooms, gave the rug in the living room a good vacuum, dusted, cleaned the TV, you know, just got things in order. The guest room doesn't get dirty because nobody's ever in there. So it is still ready for her and everything like that. I vlogged a little bit yesterday, but it was like after the library, it was go time. Go, 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 go time. And um, we did grocery shop. I will insert my TikTok um grocery haul so that way you guys can see it but yeah i did i did go ahead and grocery shop so we are gonna go ahead and get this um cart ready i am 35 weeks and i was having like you know when your body's preparing for labor you could pretty much have like contractions like every day before you go into real labor i was definitely having contractions last night so we gotta get this stuff done and then we can rest um we're going to target today which is good because i need new bathroom rugs for my bathroom and the guest bathroom because if raquel takes a shower tonight she ain't gonna have no rugs to step on so when we go to the store i'm gonna get some new rugs but yeah let's go ahead and get this um cart together
All right, you guys, so this is what it looks like. I'll probably put like the little peri bottle, switch what side this is on and put like the peri bottle over there with some extra wipes. Okay, peri bottle in the front, extra wipes there. Um, like I said, I also wanna put like some extra underwear in here in case I bleed through when I'm wearing pads. And then we have all the extra hygiene stuff down at the bottom. Oh, <laughs> People trip me out when they do that with bands. I have never seen a I feel like it used to be more. All right, y'all, this is what our cart is looking like. Out of line. Out of line. Well, there's already some stuff that we already put in here that wasn't on the list, like this. No, actually. One of those things in there. Like, no, two of them. Oh, two of them, yep. Yeah. And then. I just need this. <laughs> Let's just go. <laughs> We're not going to talk about it. <laughs> okay. All right, you guys. We're done at Target. We're having a snack. And then we're going to Walmart. We're on it. We're on a mission on a to mission. complete her hospital bag. It's a must. So it's almost done. It's 99% done. Yeah. We need... Yeah. Well, the Benadryl cream, is that for you or the Not for the boys. So we just need two more things. But mm -hmm. we got this. This is good. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right, we got our little snacky snacks. I got bacon cheese fries. Yes, those nachos look real good. Yeah. I'm so oh, 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 oh. <laughs> All right, you guys, we are back from Target, Walmart, and eating. <laughs> and, uh,. This is everything that we got. Raquel was so sweet and bought a lot of it for me too. We got size four diapers. That's the first box of size four. Size three diapers. We're officially done buying size three. Wipes. Um, I got these. I told you guys I was going to buy more overnight pads. I found these at Target. And it's 12 of them for 14 bucks. So it was a lot cheaper than paying like 16 for two packs of seven and then we got the boys some toys some water balloons um i got them toothbrushes and floss and then we found this on sale this has my full body deodorant and my um stretch prep or stretch prep balm i don't need that i'll give that to somebody but that and then we got this for the baby. Has the, I guess, to help the baby fart. <laughs> and the snot sucker, the nail clipper set, and um, to bathe him. We got these two packs of wipes because I'm a nighttime showerer. And I don't want to, like, so in the mornings I want to wake up and freshen up. So I got some body wipes. I got this, um, it's like a haka. So I got one of those. I got the Perry bottle. We got some, we, I was debating on getting a diaper genie, but we both agreed since my trash can has a lid, like just getting like these little bags to put poop diapers in was more affordable. You know, I just remembered. Oh, we were supposed to look at the doggy bags. <sighs> Too late now, these are bought. <laughs> when I refill it, I'll buy doggy bags. <laughs> got another bag another pack of feminine wipes two things of hand sanitizer because my kids ain't gonna be coming in here with these nasty hands touching my baby no <laughs> got an all-over balm for the baby um little um travel size stuff for the hotel hand sanitizer listerine um johnson and johnson this is actually for brian for his hands this is for baby and then this is for king he went outside and got into something and had hives all over him and he was super itchy so i got him some anti-itch cream and i think that that's it i just gotta finish packing my bag with some of the stuff that raquel got me so i she got me some socks so i'm gonna put these over the compression socks just because my feet get really really cold really fast Yes, I, those are not yours. Remember, you already got a new toothbrush. Mm -hmm. Those are for your brothers. Mm -hmm. Do they act like mine? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so 
So Raquel got me these two little like cute, really cute nightgowns. So I figured for day one, day, day two of being in the hospital, I'm gonna wear the cuter one when I'm starting to feel not like I just had surgery. And then for day one, I'm gonna wear the, for day one, I'm gonna wear the zipper one just because Y'all know, they be in there, like, pushing on your stomach, lifting up everything, and I'd rather them just unzip it. Like, you're already seeing me in all my glory. You may as well just zip this down. So, <laughs> and then this two-piece set is going to be my leaving the hospital outfit. So, that will be that. Oh, and then the postpartum um, belly band. If you don't know, after you have a C-section, you just feel like everything's about to fall out everything so those help a ton so i'm gonna finish getting excuse me i'm out of breath i'm gonna finish getting a lot of this stuff into my um hospital bag all right you guys so we are going to start start packing my hospital bag so i'm really not going to take pads or anything like that just because the hospitals give you some so i have four pairs of like post See, so these are really just Hanes women's boxer briefs, but I figured the way they're designed would be great for after my C-section. I am taking these style of, nor of nursing bras because I figured since I'm just going to be in the hospital, I don't need to like look lifted or anything. I really want to be comfortable after my surgery. So I'm taking uh, these bras. I am currently charging my pump to add in here, but I'm gonna go ahead and add these um, nursing pads. I have four pairs of compression socks because like I said, having a C-section that we're gonna add in here. And then we have an extra long charger that I'm gonna put in here. I'll put the port later but we got the charger. So makeup and all that good stuff will be packed at a later date. Um, so I have dry shampoo. I plan on straightening my hair the week that we go. And then toothbrush, toothbrushes for hubby and I. Toothpaste. And then I'll buy some travel size um, hygiene stuff today when I go to the store so that goes in there and then we have our loofahs and then the week of I will put fresh towel body towels in here for us and some uh what am I trying to say some shower shoes is what I'm trying to say so so far this is everything that I've got and so I'll Keep y'all updated as I continue to put more in here. Also, makeup will be packed probably the night before I go in for my C-section. All right, you guys, so let's go ahead and finish packing our stuff. I ended up finding this um, whole little set at Target on sale for 20 bucks. Oh my gosh. So we got the all over body deodorant, a little mini hand sanitizer, Listerine, um, his and her body wash and then I'll stick my husband's uh, deodorant in here at a later date so the hygiene bag is done makeup bag will probably be packed the night before I almost forgot to add this in there we are going to take these all over wipes not only for myself but for baby because if you didn't know, they, whenever you have a C-section, you really can't shower the first day. And I hate the way I feel after I have a C-section. So I'm going to have hubby wipe me down afterwards. So go on the front. Hygiene bag in here on the side. We have the postpartum belly band because after a C-section, it just feels like your insides are going to fall out. Put that in there. Mm. Let's see. Let's stand this up on the side. So for coming home, I have this little green two-piece set that I got off of TikTok shop. 
that's going in there. And then my best friend bought me these gowns. So I figured this would be day one, like fresh postpartum C-section. And then this would be day two. And the hospital bag is officially done with the exception of my laptop, charger, and makeup. And the hospital bag is complete. Almost forgot the fuzzy socks to go over the compression socks because my feet get so cold. I'm just gonna stuff these in this side pocket right here. Okay, so I almost forgot to pack my house shoes and some towels. So that's gonna go at the bottom of this bag. Whew. And then we're gonna go ahead and pack my makeup up and leave it on the counter. All right, you guys, so this is actually a part of um, a whole luggage set or like a weekend bag set, I should say. We're gonna go ahead and pack my makeup for the hospital in this. So first things first, I only use three brushes, contour, blush. We'll take these two for eyeshadow and face powder can't forget the spongy sponge and now we have eyebrows we've got our skincare this is the snail mucin um hyaluronic acid dewy skin serum let's make sure that's closed um, that's for the daytime this is for nighttime my face oil concealer Brows and bronzer, highlight and blush, lips, well, my lip tint, Ooh. we'll pick that up. And then this is where it's key. So on um, TikTok shop, you can actually get these trio sets for really cheap. So you, so you can get this mascara, this eyeliner, and this lippy for like super a super discounted price, or you can get this trio for a super discounted price so check it out on tiktok shop especially if you're a mom that just needs like quick easy sets like that it, it has really helped me get my makeup done within 15 minutes every day mirror and that is it you guys